Alright y'all, it's AGP here and it's Wednesday. So you know what time it is. It's time for another AGP video. Alright y'all, so basically today, um, this is kind of a quick one because there wasn't a whole lot of info I could get. I might do one on Friday about the reviews for Resident Evil 3, we'll see. But right now we're just going to talk about Cyberpunk 2077 and how that CD, CD Project Red hooked us up with some two new wallpapers that look kind of cool. Um, I'm going to show them here on the screen, of course. You can see both of them. Um, that's awesome. You can download these wallpapers at the CD Projekt Red website, which is lit. Um, and it's awesome because they're getting us more and more hype for a game that's already highly anticipated. Now, y'all know it was supposed to come out. Uh, what was supposed to come out in April so this month because it's April 1st But now it's coming out in September, but that's okay You know that they're working on it from home because of the pandemic all this crazy stuff going on But they were the ones to put out an article Talking about how they've moved everybody to in-home working and they've improved their infrastructure and technology So that people can efficiently work from home to get the game out on September 17th, which is what we're looking for So that's what's up. That's what we need. It's not gonna get delayed because of the pandemic. So that's great. Um, basically, you see these two wallpapers. They're both pretty cool. Um, one has a little bit more going on than the other, as you can tell or see. There's some speculation on the uh, different stuff going on in each. In the first one, you see the female V character. Uh, she's kind of holding this origami thing. Now, you know, in Cyberpunk 2077, you're descriptive as a outlaw mercenary who is looking for some kind of piece that's the key to the immortality um so you know with something like that that's that crazy it's basically like looking for the fountain of youth or el dorado everybody's gonna be after that uh you see in the second picture you see the male v character sitting there on the train um and there's a lot going on there's people in the back behind the window the the door is being broken somebody is dead somebody got shot somebody is just chilling there's a pulp fiction reference and somebody just doesn't give a shit so that's what's up and when i say that's what's up i don't mean that all of it is what's up i mean it's what's up that there's a lot going on but the fact that somebody is taking the dirt nap is not is not what's up uh so you got a few things going on um you know you can in in cyberpunk 2077 it's gonna be a hell of an experience if you like the witcher i'm sure you'll like this i know i i didn't play the witcher but cyberpunk 2077 looks pretty uh cool and it looks like there's gonna be a lot going on you have to fight different groups you know you can customize your play style skill set cyberware you know, and then depending on the choices you make, you'll have different outcomes of the story. But I'm sure in all of them, you have to deal with all this going on in the back of this uh, this wallpaper. I don't know. Y'all gotta tell me, do you feel like this is increasing the hype for it? Or do you, uh, are you like, I don't want to look at this because I want the game, out, game to come out now. I'd appreciate it if they didn't give me more stuff that's going to give me more hype because my hype is already at, you know, the, the, my teapot is about to... You know, it's about to it's about to go off. Like I'm already boiling, and I'm just waiting for the game to come out. And now that you pushed it back, we gotta wait five more months than we would have. It's life. You know, it's not it's not it's not great, but you know, it happens. Uh, at least it's not being delayed because of the pandemic, because that would have sucked. Because then we probably wouldn't be getting it until the end of the year, and it might not. And it might have been if that was the case, it might have gotten delayed to a point where it would have came out. You know, when the new systems came out. That's not saying that. You know, it just means that they would have made a copy for both this year, this generation systems and next generation systems, and they would just come out at the same time. But you know, as long as they do that, they're completely in their rights. And I think they're people get a little bit confused about speculations and delays, but really, I'm pretty sure most of the time you can delay um, as long as you have like you know some kind of public statement or you know i mean it's not written in contract that you can't and a lot of games get delayed often yeah so you know this is what this is what we got for this weekend that's what's up it looks cool tell me if y'all gonna download these wallpapers i might i may just have to just because they look cool as long as they don't cost any money then i i might just download them on another note you know final fantasy 7 actually is kind of released a little early some people in australia have copies i don't know if y'all saw this article uh but yeah, some people have copies. They got the game a little early. I don't know. They got leaked on some weird situation. So, they have them already. But, y'all, if y'all wait for Final Fantasy VII, that's coming out on April 10th. So, you only have about a week anyway. So, you know, 
we'll be cooling. But yeah, y'all let me know if you're gonna download these uh the Cyberpunk 2077 wallpapers if you're excited for it. I know this is really a quick video. I just wanted to come talk to y'all about that and tell y'all, you know, and see see what's up with it. Cause I, I may or may not download them. But yeah, y'all just gotta let me know if you will. And um I'm gonna catch y'all next time, all right? AGP out. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And you know, come join the AGP fam. We do videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So let's let's get it. All right? Peace.